Welcome back to another episode Ikimi and today we have a bunch of interesting topics to talk about. First things first, it seems like GSC and TGV now allows you to book the entire cinema hall just for gaming and I think it's a pretty good deal if you're inviting a bunch of friends. And ahead of the official launch of the Proton X50, the company has released 4 promo videos of the SUV which gives us a better look of the Proton X50. For more details, remember to keep watching. Want to play your favourite console games on a big screen? GSC now allows you to book the entire cinema hall for gaming for 188 ringgit for 3 hours. The GSC Big Screen Gaming Experience is only available at GSC Queen's Bay Mall, GSC Ipoh Parade, GSC Paradigm Mall Johor Bahru and GSC Aeon Bandar Raya Melaka. And obviously, it's not available in Klang Valley because we are currently under CMCO. To book, you need to contact GSC by dropping an email to marketing at gsc.com.my. GSC offers two types of gaming packages. If it's just purely for gaming, it costs 188 ringgit for 3 hours. And if you need more time, you can add on 70 ringgit for each additional hour required. And to complete your gaming party experience, you can go for the second package which includes food and beverages. It costs 250 ringgit for 3 hours and it includes food and drinks worth up to 75 ringgit and you will also get a 200 ringgit voucher that's valid from 1st of January until the 30th of June 2021. If you need more time to play, you can extend another 2 hours for 100 ringgit extra. Besides GSC, TGV is also offering the same service where you can play your PS4 as well as your Nintendo Switch on a big screen. You can bring your own console and rent the halls for 180 ringgit. For a group of 20, that's around 9 ringgit per person. However, according to TGV, the hall rental for gaming is available at all locations except for KL and Selangor. TGV offers a total of 3 packages. The base master package lets you use their cinema hall for 3 hours for 180 ringgit. If you need popcorn and drinks, you can get the epic package which offers 3 hours of usage and 5 regular popcorn combo for 230 ringgit. Meanwhile, its highest legend package at 280 ringgit gives you 4 hours of in-haul gaming and the choice of 5 regular popcorn or hot food combos. And if you need more time, it will cost you 50 ringgit per hour. And as part of the cinema rules, outside food and drinks are not allowed. Similar to GSC, the console and games are not included so you have to bring your own. Customers are also advised to come 20 minutes earlier to set up their console for the big screen. So which game titles would you recommend to play in the cinema? Let us know in the comments below. During the launch of the Huawei Mate 40 series, Huawei has also introduced their first over-ear headphones called the FreeBud Studio. The new headphones have active noise cancellation and it features a 40mm sound driver which is similar to the Sony WH-1000X Mark IV. Just like the recently introduced FreeBuds Pro, the new headphones support intelligent dynamic ANC which automatically changes its noise cancellation mode depending on the environment you're in. If you need to be alert of your surroundings, there's a pass-through awareness mode which pipes in ambient sound. There's also a voice mode which enhances human voices while suppressing unwanted background noise. The Huawei FreeBud Studio is officially priced at 1,199 ringgit in Malaysia. If you're interested, it will be going on sale from the 30th of October 2020. Although the Sony WH-1000X Mark IV officially retails for 1,599 ringgit, you can easily find one for less than 1,100 ringgit during online sales. So will you pick this over the Sony headphones? Do let us know in the comments below. The official launch of the Proton X50 will be happening tomorrow which is on the 27th of October 2020. However, due to the current pandemic situation, the new compact SUV will be announced virtually through a Facebook live stream. Ahead of its official launch, the car maker has released 4 new X50 promo videos which covers its design, performance, safety and infotainment system. Some of the key features shown include remote engine start, lane keep assist, autonomous emergency braking and auto park assist. The vehicle shown in the promo videos is the top-of-the-line X50 flagship that comes with a 1.5-litre 3-cylinder turbo direct fuel injection engine which produces 175 horsepower. The flagship model is the only variant that gets the Advanced Driver Assistance System with Level 2 Autonomous Driving features. On top of that, the variant also offers dual-tone exterior and a panoramic sunroof. The Proton X50 launch is taking place at 10.50am on 27th of October via Proton's Facebook page. This is the moment most people have been waiting for as Proton will finally reveal the price of all four variants. Based on the claim bookings received, it looks like there's going to be a long waiting list for the new SUV. And thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like this video if you liked it and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already and also click on the notification bell icon so you can stay updated to our future videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!